Good morning or good afternoon everyone, depending on where you're joining us from. My name is Key Knewell from the Business Review and I'll be today's host. I'm delighted to have with us today Rosen, who will be discussing compact inline inspection tools for bi-directional operations. We're joined by Tom Steinvorte. Tom is the Manager of Products and Services within the Challenging Diagnostic Division Pipelines at Rosen. And while um, I have this opportunity, I'd like to remind you that you have the option to submit questions using the questions tool at the top right of your screen. So please do so any time throughout the presentation. Tom will then allocate around 15 minutes to try and answer any questions or thoughts. Another thing that I would like to um, let, let you know about today's presentation is that we will be holding three polls um, for you to answer just um, some simple questions that we would like you know, your interaction with. So we do appreciate you answering these polls. We will also be sharing the results that we have from these today. So without further ado, please let me welcome Tom. Hello, good morning or good afternoon to you all. Um, first of all, uh, thank you very much for uh, attending uh, this uh, webinar. You did. Uh, today I'd like to discuss uh, the ultra compact inline inspection tools for bidirectional operation. Uh, this uh, new development provides new opportunities for the inspection of uh, pipelines that used to be classified unpickable. Um, I'd like to first take you to the content of today's presentation. I'd like to start with an introduction of the, the company, the Rosen Group. Uh, then I'd like to discuss uh, unpickable pipelines. Uh, what is the definition of an unpickable pipeline? What makes an unpickable pipeline, or perhaps challenging, is more appropriate? And what are now typical challenges? Um, I said one of the recent developments is the ultra short bidirectional MFL inspection tools. I'd like to introduce them to you. We're going to talk about the design, the features, and the capabilities. 